Okay, I think I see it. I think I see it. It's right there. Okay. Right there. Nice. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Sorry for the quality of this video. Um, because I don't have my regular gear. It's just my cell phone. But anyway, um, today's a great day. I just got a call from my salesman at my Honda dealership and he told me the car that I placed an order on just arrived and um, don't get me wrong <laughs> um, I'm super excited about this uh, fun fact it's not a sports car uh, because I'm used to buy like only sports car for it's been forever I mean I, I'm used to just buy when I'm buying a new car it's like 95% of the time it's a sports car and um, it's actually a truck it's the first time I'm actually buying a brand new truck and one of the reason why I decided to do this and uh, buy a truck is because you know for the past four years we've been looking for a way to bring the Jetta to the States and stuff like that and you know I don't feel comfortable driving the fast and furious cars on the road anymore um, so it was the logical choice just buying a truck so without further ado we are going to take the road well I'm not actually already on the road but uh, we are going to drive to my dealership and I'm going to show you my brand new car uh, I'm not going to take delivery of it today there's a bunch of accessories that they need to put on but uh, at least you're going to see it first so we are on our way to the dealership in the Civic Type R as you can see and um, I'm I'm actually stoked it's gonna be it's gonna be different as you may know or not know because I don't think I actually talked about this I sold my Honda Element about about two months ago uh, because I was keep getting my cat converters stolen from me so I decided to sell the Element and move some cars around and I decided to get a new daily but a brand new daily like brand new car and it's gonna be fun it's gonna be much more comfortable to drive than the Element and uh, you're going to see why in just a few so my dealership is right over here and uh, let's turn right there careful there's a huge bump here and uh, where is he nice Corvette it should be okay I think I see it I think I see it. It's right there. Okay. Right there. Nice. Oh yeah. Look at this. Brand new ridge line. Wow. <laughs> There you have it. It's a, it's a 2021 Honda Ridgeline Black Edition. Um, right now, there's not much accessories installed to it. It just arrived, but uh, we are going to install the tonneau cover, the rock guards on the side, a lift kit. It's gonna be dope. Right, beautiful, beautiful truck. There's a lot of people who don't like the Ridgeline, but I feel like uh, this one is beautiful. It's different than the Type R, but so here in Canada, the Ridgeline, the Black Edition is uh, $55,000 plus the options. Uh, we are going to put the rock guards on the sides. Um, the bed is nice. I also want to uh, install the black badge everywhere. So right now we are Friday the 17th. Uh, I'm 
thinking the delivery of the truck will be next week, probably on Wednesday. Like I said, they need to install the rock guards, the roof rack, the tonneau cover, and um, also once everything's done, the car will go to Protex Canada and they are going to install the PPF on it. Then we are going to bring the truck to the shop, install the lift kit to raise the suspension. And at some point we are going to install just like the Type R, just like my other cars, we are going to install brand new Toyo tires, a bit meatier. Um, it's gonna look dope. And also once everything's done, this truck will bring the other new car to my shop, Small Int. It's a Honda S2000. You probably already know that by now, but anyway, it's gonna be dope. So uh, it was, like I said, it was just a small video. Let me know in the comment section down below, do you think the Ridgeline is a truck or a car? I'm curious, but let me know your thought about the truck. My goal is to build an Overlander out of it. Uh, a bit lifted, big tires, big wheels. It's gonna be awesome. Uh, like I said, if you have some, some suggestions about the, the, this project, let me know in the comment section down below. And uh, until then, I see you in the next one. Goodbye.